But there's so much history here. I mean, we went up to the, 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 to the mountains and there was a coal mine, a, a closed down coal mine. And none of us had shaved in about six weeks. This is a great little folklore story, and it's true. And the album was meant to be called Wanted Dead or Alive. And we all grew beards. And, and we took these pictures in this coal mine. And we had long dusters on and beards and mustaches. And we turned in the album cover. And the record company got the picture, and they said, over our dead bodies. <laughs> <laughs> like, there is zero chance that we're letting you guys turn into mountain men <laughs> after two records. <laughs> And so they said, and if you don't have, because now Bad Name was on the radio. They said, if you don't have an album covering by tonight, we've got a problem. And we're gonna put out a picture that was taken from a dance club down here in town. And they cropped it. And it was as bright as this Lori Logan's shirt. <laughs> and they cropped a girl from here to here. And they matched the uh, border to Lori's shirt. Mm -hmm. And there was no fax machines. There was no computers at the time. There were, you couldn't get here on a direct flight. You know, it was difficult to get mail here. And a Xerox machine made a blue copy. Because remember the blue, boy, well, you won't remember, but anybody here old enough, you might remember. Blue copy of this, of this terribly cropped picture based on a picture from the number five. And somebody then two days later sent me the pink outline and I said this will be the end of our career it'll be over it'll be over a pink album cover I says it's over if you won't let me have my beard and then you want pink what's the compromise and I took a black hefty garbage bag squirted it with water wrote slippery when wet and said here's your album cover biggest selling albums of all time, true story.